Hello, it is day 452. I am in Central Park, of course. <laughs> there aren't many places to go to during the quarantine. And so we were in a curfew situation for the past week because of the riots and the violence happening in our country. And last night they removed the curfew. Last night was supposed to be the final night and apparently things have gotten better. And so we were dismissed of the curfew. And last night was super chaotic in my neighborhood. I live in Midtown Manhattan and every five seconds, I it, that's what it felt like. There was sirens going off, fire trucks, police. I mean, it was constant. The moment it stopped, it began within like 30 seconds. So I had a hard time sleeping and also it's really distracting to be in that constantly and this is not how it normally is it's just been because of what's been happening in our country and one of the things that i, I have really been strong and focused working on my business working on my goals and one of the th during this time with this stuff it's it's still hard it, it requires an insane amount of discipline and concentration and focus so one of the things that i do to really keep me going with my discipline and my focus to work on the things that are really important to me and to try my best not to get distracted. There are times that it does happen. I do get distracted, but I don't get distracted for long because I have a very strong why. Why do I do what I do? Why do I want what I want? Why am I doing the work that I'm doing to get where I want to be? And why do I want that thing that I ultimately want? So I don't know if this makes any sense. The reason I'm sharing this, if you are getting distracted, if you are all over the place, because especially because of what's happening, have a strong why. Why do you want what you want? And usually it's not the first reason that comes up. It's usually the 50th reason. The reason I am still so focused and disciplined on my work is because I want freedom. I want freedom of choices, financial freedom. I want to be able to do whatever I want, whenever I want, wherever I want, with whomever I want, however I want. Freedom of choices, that is my why, my very strong why that drives me to continue to do what I'm doing even when it gets super, super chaotic and it has gotten that way for the past week here in New York. So just wanted to remind you of that. If, if you are all over the place, get a pen and paper and start writing down why. Why do you want what you want? Usually it uh, has to do with some type of freedom. That's what I have found with anyone, most of the people that I've done this exercise with in the past. And um, my voice is starting to crack right now. <laughs> I didn't sleep very well last night, so I'm going to go. But remember, a strong why will get you through the toughest times and will get you back on track really quickly. It works for me every time. I'll see you later. Bye.